following video will be the last video you ever see of Exotic MTG as you know it. At the end of 2020, it all changes. What's up, friendos? It is me, Exotic MTG. Today I'm bringing you the Christmas edition of the 31 Days of Christmas. I am Marcus with Exotic MTG, and there's a lot to go over. So if you hate the intros and information on giveaways and stuff on the channel, then skip to like, I don't know, the third. I, I don't know. Today we're going to be bringing you a, a double giveaway. We're giving away two subscription boxes to two different winners and um it's going to be a little different than what you're normally used to seeing on my channel so first let's thank our sponsors for the third annual 31 days of christmas that is crazy to think about it's the third annual it just seems like yesterday i was sitting at my desk thinking of clever ways i could work with other content creators and this is what i came up with and here we are uh, I also want to do a special shout out to Project MTG because without him, I cannot do this. He is working his butt off all the time uh, once like November hits. So thanks, Project MTG. Court, you are amazing. The sponsors for this year are myself, Exotic MTG, The Lotus Council, Geekified, Ultra Pro, Inked Gaming, Altered Sleeves, Wizards of the Coast, Card Sphere. And last but not least, Card Kingdom. We have a jumble of stuff to go over. And let's start with the current acting giveaway for our Discord. We have 30 packs of double masters that are going to be given away today. So get on the Discord link down below and enter to win that. That will be in the giveaway uh, or the giveaways channel, sub channel. So 30 different winners. 30 packs of Double Masters. It'll be a lot of fun. We'll open those up live on our next Twitch stream. So check those out. The next thing that we need to go over is how freaking cruel our community is. Uh, so I always want to do the uplifting stuff. You know, I want to do giveaways and I want to be positive. And sometimes that's really difficult to do. So while talking with my team, uh, we decided that we were going to do a naughty and nice list giveaway. So we're going to go over some naughty comments that we've received recently and some nice comments. And uh, we'll be packing our naughty and nice subscription boxes and uh, it should be a lot of fun. All right, friendos, it's time to make our naughty and nice boxes. These are the subscription boxes brought to you by Exotic MTG. You can find these by going to exoticmtg.com slash box. There are three different ways to purchase, so pick, pick whatever way you'd like. You can either get it on demand, do it monthly or quarterly. So I do hope you enjoy these, and we are going to start packing them now while reading some very, very rude comments on the uh, Open Boosters channel. If you like Open Boosters, shout out to you. I love him. He is an awesome guy, a good friend, and uh, he opened one of these boxes on his channel, and basically every single comment on there is crazy. <laughs> uh, people think that a lot of this stuff, I guess, is just has no value. So, if you don't like them, that's fine. You know, you do you. I'm going to make these because I know that there's going to be people that appreciate them. And again, we're going to start at the top and we're just going to read these as I pack these boxes. And again, you can find these if you want to rebut these. These are at Open Booster's YouTube channel and it is, his, as of right now, his second to newest video on his channel. So, enjoy as I pack these naughty and nice uh, list boxes up and we read some very fun and interesting, hateful, rude, crappy comments. So, um, and just a, uh, just a little bit of information. We're going to put the lesser items in the naughty box and the nicer items in the nice box. So we'll start with the old business card and the new business card just for fun. So that makes sense, right? So rather than, for example, be before we start reading comments, uh, this box will get two sealed Zendikar Rising Booster Packs, and this one will get two sealed Zendikar Rising Booster Packs and one of the special packs that I have in certain boxes. These are all randomized, except for in this video for this purpose. So enjoy. Here we go. So as I go over the stickers, I'll read the first comment with the most likes. This looks like hot garbage. You are too nice open boosters. So 
a lot of people on there basically just think that he shouldn't have done that. And you know what? Maybe he shouldn't have. But some people think that these cool vinyl stickers are worth nothing. And I think they're freaking amazing. So we're going to put uh, a couple stickers. Let's put one Tamiyo in there and a dragon. And then the naughty one will just get Anissa. Other than two, it'll just get the one. So these stickers, there's plenty of different ones. They're really nice. Put them on your binders, put them on your desk, wherever you want. These stickers are very high quality and I freaking think they're awesome. Uh, apparently they're not cool enough for any of the haters on the YouTube. But next, let's go ahead and go over the life counters that I think are freaking amazing. Obviously the two um, on one is the more expensive one. So that will go in the nice box. This is made, this is handcrafted with wood. And uh, yeah, it goes up to 60. You can keep track of your life and your opponents. This will be bubble wrapped. And obviously all these things will be nicely packed for the winners. But I'll be putting that one in the nice box and the naughty box will just get the single one. Still very nice little gift to get, but you've been naughty. So you go over there. Uh, the next comment I'm seeing here, everyone is always looking for ways to make money off their bulk. Uh, okay. Well, the, that's an opinion that you can have. So because they are going to be rude, <laughs> we should maybe go over something that they might consider bulk. Uh, he opened, I think he ended up getting a sealed package of morning tide cards that are all packed fresh. So um, we'll put those in the nice box. And then the uh, package baggie of uh, Modern Horizons we'll put in the naughty box because uh, it's not as cool as Morning Tide. Yes, those may be commons, uh, but they're pack fresh. They're very good sets, and if you don't like them, that's fine. You don't you don't have to. It's just a little added goodie in these boxes. Not every item in here is going to be a home run. We want to fill them with all kinds of varieties. All right. So we've got the sealed packs added. Now let's look at some dice options. So we've got different kinds of dice. And I know that uh, people apparently think these just are free as well. But these cost money. These have a value to them. They're very high quality and nice. But apparently because they're not cards, they are obviously worthless. So let's read another comment. The guy who opens beta boosters made a valiant effort trying not to sound disappointed while opening land packs and unset rares. I love your positive attitude, open boosters, but it is not exciting for you, then it is not exciting for us either. The life counter was definitely awesome, yes, and it's not a cheap item. I added that part, sorry. The life counter was, it was definitely awesome and was the only point in the video you sounded genuinely interested Not all boxes get unset, okay? For example, since we're on the subject, the, the card he got in his on Open Booster's channel was something like this, okay? But we have to have these kinds of cards in order to get cards like this, okay? We have to. We have to have uh, Raging Revines so we can have an Ugin, the Spirit Dragon foil. Okay. Yes, open boosters box was 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 a, a more disappointing box. And I'll do better, you know, at, at trying to realize that a couple awesome handcrafted stuff isn't gonna be enough to make someone happy if they get unset rares. Okay. I will be aware of that. But I really need people to understand that. Not every box is going to have a Chrome Mox. Or what is this? An Agadim's Awakening. Or a Foil Ugin the Spirit Dragon. You know, some of them are going to have Geth in there. Some of them are going to have a Sword of Feast and Famine. It's just the nature of this kind of business. There has to be boxes worth $30 for there to be boxes worth $70. Okay, that's what subscription boxing is all about. And if you're only interested in value and cards, then this isn't for you. Okay, but 
Let's go ahead while we're on the subject of cards. We've got two stacks of the same item. These will all eventually be in subscription boxes as long as our sales continue to happen. Thank you to those that the 10 or so of you that have already subscribed. A couple of you that have ordered boxes. Thank you so much. So we're going to pick the two cards off the top. And the most expensive one will be in the nice. And the most non-expensive one will be in the naughty. So we have a mica slint lattice and a cigar cigar to host of Hurons. So I would say that it's going to be like this. Cigar to goes in the naughty box and the the lattice goes in the nice box. So let's go ahead and find our next delicious comment. Oh Lord, what a box full of garbage. Don't encourage these repack companies. Interesting. Well, I guess we'll just add a land pack there and we'll put um Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. I have four different types of land packs as far as the ones in the penny sleeves go. This is type number four. They all have different values. Um, so I'll just show you what this one has in it, and then I'll put it in the nice box. Looks like just a bunch of full arts in the type four. Okay. I know that there's others with older, older lands that are foil. There are uh, full art unhinged. There are full art unstable, lots of cool different land packs. That's what we'll put in this one. And I wanted to go and look at the dice. And we got the glass tokens are really neat. I think they're amazing. And those are done by uh, Art by Patton. Payton, sorry, Payton. Those are done by Art by Payton, these glass tokens. And then we've got another set of dice. We will Put these in the naughty box and we'll put, this is another set of the glass tokens. We'll put these in the nice box. Just more cool artsy craftsy stuff. And what's another item? Oh, proxies. It's time for proxies. Do you not like proxies? Well, I love proxies because as a collector, I like to play, uh, let's see, is there a volcanic island in here? I would rather have this volcanic island proxy in my uh, EDH deck at my buddy's house when we're drinking than my actual revised near mint volcanic island. Uh, so if you don't like proxy stuff, well, everyone's different, right? So we will put a tundra in our little flexi sleeve here. And I will, actually, I'm going to take it out of this one. I guess what I'm getting at is I just wish that people could just move on. If they, if they see something they don't enjoy, just move on. Spend your efforts elsewhere. All right, so we got that in there. And then we've got some of my untap this repacks. Okay, now... It wasn't talked about in the video, but they are called untap this because if you whiff, if you don't get a hit, it's just an unstable card, okay? But if you get a hit, it or if you get something other than an unstable card, then you get a rare or mythic from a different set. It's, it's pretty simple. I have these only valued at a dollar. So it's not like I'm saying, hey, here's, here's a $10 repack. This is just valued at a dollar. So we will give one to the naughty one and three to the nice. See how we're doing this? All right. As I look around here, we've got just a couple of things. I got some pretty sweet counters. I'll put the Termagoyf life counter in the nice and the insect, the bug with the naughty box. And, um, yeah, did we get the stickers? I think we did. Some pretty sweet stickers, uh, just in case you didn't see them. Here's the stickers. Here's one of my favorites. Ella Schnorn. Pretty awesome sticker. These are very high quality. So if you're interested in a box, you now know how to get one. 
We also have cool items like uh, dice holders, 3D printed dice, dragon dice holders. We'll put one in each box. I hope you have a fabulous, amazing Christmas. And we will end this video with one more awesome comment. Worst opening I've seen on this channel. And you're too nice trying not to sound disappointed. Don't encourage this kind of garbage from their store, from other stores. Just a content creator, dude. Welcome to the end, folks. I figured it was only right if we used this play mat. This is the final pack opening you will likely see on this channel. This will be my goodbye to you viewers, the patrons, the supporters of all kinds. We're going to be opening up a pack of Stronghold. We're not exactly going away. We're just going a different direction. We're going to do different kinds of videos. Uh, we'll leave it at that as far as details, but we're just not going to be doing pack openings anymore. So without further ado, we're going to roll the credits and our thank yous will start showing up from the bottom there. And let's see what we'll get on our last pack, and op cat pack opening at Exotic MTG. Uh, the reason I chose Stronghold is because I just completed the whole set. I now have one of every card from Stronghold in Near Mint. And uh, I figured that was a great reason to open one. We will likely be giving these cards away in our Discord. If you're not a part of the Discord, there's no reason why you shouldn't join. We have Ransack, a Shifting Wall, Victual Sliver, Sliver, Mind Warper, Leap, Mog Flunkies, Mulch, Torment, Change of Heart, Dream Prowler. I actually just had to buy this card as one of the last cards I needed to complete the set. That's funny. Furnace Spirit, Provoke, Rabid Rats. Venerable Monk, and Hammerhead Shark. So the last card we're going to pull at Exotic MTG is a Hammerhead Shark. Very interesting. Again, thank you to all. Make sure you watch all the credits. And uh, you're all very important to me. So we will see you on the flip side. Peace. Although we're not done, we're just done opening packs. Goodbye, friendos.